Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Amy, and I'm so glad you clicked on today's video. Today, I am going to be rushing at my school. I'm going to be doing a rush vlog with me, showing you guys the journey of how it is. Today is orientation. It is at 6.30. I actually have a club meeting to go to at 4.30 for a marketing club. I want to concentrate on marketing for business, so I want to check it out first. So I'm going to get ready for the rush thing so I don't have to literally run back to my dorm to like change. So I just want to like have a like relax and chill process to like get there um, to the orientation. So I'm going to change right now and I will come back and do my makeup. Alrighty guys, I just changed. I have this yellow top. I have this yellow top from Princess Polly. It has like flowers on it and it's a corset. And then I have these Levi jeans. They have like little wrappers on it. They're high-waisted. And I have my Converse on. And then I am about to do my hair a little bit. Put a little bit of makeup on. I'm hoping that the meeting runs early so I can come back and like really fully fix up. But if not, <laughs> I'm going to have to ask my roommate to come and help me. But yeah, that is it. Um, I wanted to do a little bit of makeup before I have a little bit of time left. Um, I am excited for the rush process. I have no idea what to expect at all. Um, I am excited. I feel like I'm a little nervous right now just because I have a lot on my plate right now especially like going to a meeting back to back it's definitely um not the most ideal thing i literally also found out that this meeting was tomorrow yesterday i found out it was today so it's super cute but yeah i will see you guys in a little bit and wish me luck my final look i have some light makeup on i did my hair the meeting ended a little bit earlier ended like 30 minutes early which is really nice because i got time to like fix up my makeup do my hair so i added this louis vuitton bag and yeah i really like my outfit it is super cute and yeah i'm just really excited so yeah wish me luck i am super excited to start a new journey in my life hello everyone it is super late right now i just came back from day two of fresh orientation day it was super fun i had a really good time i talked to a lot of girls um in like the chapters and just kind of got to know them i feel like for me i kind of just like you could tell like which house or like which chapter you liked the best and which ones you felt like you connected more with and i Feel like i have an idea of like what i like the values the aesthetic that i like so i'm just hoping that they like feel mutually about me and i get invited back to the house i'm pretty sure i find out tomorrow i think so and yeah i'm just really excited i feel like i had a really good conversation with some of them and i feel like some of them were not the biggest connection as other ones but it's totally fine they're all super nice and everything um yeah, I feel like it's kind of hard, especially for like the last ones. Like, I feel like their energy is definitely trained and everything. Um, but yeah, I was really excited. This is my outfit. Look how cute it looks. And I have my Converse on. It looks so adorable. I met so many girls there. And yeah, I'm just like really excited how it's going. I have to go back on Saturday um, for philanthropy day. And I'm just gonna like talk about their philanthropy, like more about the values, gonna connect more with girls. But yeah, I feel like it went really well today. I have a few pictures, but yeah, um, I feel like I can't really film like the process of it because obviously I'm talking to the girls, but like they literally won't let us stick in our phones, so it's kind of like really hard. And like after we get out of like the little room we are that we're talking to, um, we grab our phone, we jot down notes, and then we put it back. Um, and one thing I also wanted to mention is that I low-key thought it was, like, a table of, like, four or five girls who are literally behind the table just, like, talking to you and they're all each asking you questions. Like, I legitimately thought that's what it was and it wasn't. I'm so freaking careful. Like, 
first off they like sing their like song that they were singing and i low-key guys i low-key thought i was like in a freaking little cult i was like girl like what am i gotten myself into i'm like what have i gotten myself into like it was like so like just like it was just different it's like what can i say um but one of the girls who i was also with like she also told me the same thing so i'm like okay um but yeah it was really fun i feel like i connected with a lot of the girls um but yeah i had to rank the seven and then my top five and those ones hopefully like they both moved me back and then a saturday it will be um you should get like five back is like the max you can get back yeah that i'm excited um yeah the girls just like did their little chant they opened the door each girl like you each had a girl for you to like talk to you and then like you talk to them and then a girl came up another girl came up so they could talk to you as well so yeah it was really cool i liked it it was really fun and um yeah that's how it went i will update you guys on saturday to see how the rest is going for me i am super excited how this whole process has just been going for me and yeah i'm really excited and i will see you guys on a saturday and i have to literally wake up at 11 a.m so let's pray for me but like loki let's pray for me on sunday because i gotta wake up at 8 a.m be there for like two and then literally come back and like be here for like three hours because i had to go back at six and yeah i think that's not my thing it's like four hours but technically because i have to be here at six it's like three and a half but yeah i'm excited i feel like this process is definitely i don't regret it because i feel like it's definitely been able to give me like communication skills i'm able to talk to more people and just like kind of find like a little flow and talking to people and i feel like that's something i really struggled with especially me being so freaking shy so i'm super glad about that um but yeah i feel like if you're planning on rushing i feel like it's a good experience just because for me first day i feel like i've definitely gained communication skills which is such an important thing especially for me going in pre-business i feel like it's such an important thing to just be able to talk to people and just communicate with people so yeah i feel like it's going super well hello everyone it is philanthropy day it is day two i am super excited for today i just came back actually because i had to leave 11 in the morning to go to philanthropy day let me show you guys what i am actually wearing today today was like supposed to be like sunday brunch kind of vibes so let me just show you a quick little outfit so i have this cute crop top little tube top situation it has these little vassals going on they're super cute and then i have this green skirt and then i have my chunky sandals they look super cute let me show you in the mirror this is what the fit's looking like this is what the fit's looking like oh my god i can't put this this is what the fit's looking like it's super cute and then basically we just talk about our the philanthropy and like what they do to help the community and just make a sound one space and just improve the world in general um unfortunately i didn't get all of my top five i got my top third one which i'm really happy about because imagine i didn't even get any of them i would have dropped out like i just would have left like, I know it's keeping up in mind, but, like, you just, you know. You know when you buy with somebody, you know when you don't. And so, like, I don't know. It just really hurt that, like, the one that I really, really wanted didn't pick me. Like, because I felt like I had such a good conversation with them. And they didn't pick me. So then it makes you think, like, it makes you rethink yourself. Like, what did I do wrong? Like, what's wrong with me? Like, why didn't they want me? so i don't know i feel like obviously in a way like 
it kind of just put you in that way and i guess in a way people don't want to rush because they feel like they're gonna look down on themselves and just think like oh what's wrong with me when babes literally nothing is wrong with you and and i had to reel myself back and remember that nothing is wrong with you this is just not the path for you and that the universe i promise you will align with what's right for you and what's right for your path and i'm just guessing that they just weren't right for my past they just weren't maybe genuine girls for me and honestly i've had such a horrible relationship with friends girls specifically who have just screwed me over so freaking much and i've honestly been so exhausted and i just wanted to leave my hometown with all that toxic negativity and just leave it behind and just come in with a positive and new mindset and just like a positive and new perspective on friends and i think the universe wants that for me to happen and it wants to align with those um intentions and i think my third one i really felt super genuine they were so nice i feel like i talked to them for so long and getting to know their philanthropy their philanthropy was alzheimer's block and my grandmother has alzheimer's or she has dementia and i feel like it's in the same range so i have a personal connection with it they also did clean up their uh city and like in high school i cleaned up my city as well so i feel like they just have a lot of similar things they value loyalty so much and that is something i value so freaking much so much so i feel like i don't know everything happens for a reason and i think they are meant for me um yeah and i'm just really excited in the beginning i was literally on the verge to cry when i called my mom and like told her the whole situation like i was literally on the verge to cry i was like let's you know and i was just about to go into my last one my third ranking one and i was literally about to cry and i was like keep it together girl and i'm like let's put a smile on my face um no but then when i saw the girl that i talked to on thursday like all those like feeling of oh i'm not worthy like just went away because i felt like truly like i belong there and like i felt welcomed and i felt loved and cared about um so yeah i'm like really excited tomorrow's preference day so i ranked three i should get into one or two tomorrow and then talk to them i'm really really hoping i get my third ranking that i ranked um if not i will literally cry and then drop out but we're not gonna manifest that into the inverse i'm gonna literally get it i i don't know i just I can feel it. i can feel the vibe i can literally feel the vibes um yeah i can feel it i can still feel it um but yeah i'm really excited and then girl i have to wake up literally at 8 a.m 8 a.m like that's no no let me rephrase that i have to be there at 8 a.m you will do that 8 a.m like you know how early i have to wake up y'all know how early i have to wake up like literally literally 6 30. <laughs> maybe rest in peace because like absolutely not but we gotta do it and yeah then it ends at one i'm pretty sure or i may be able to go home earlier and then i go back at six to announce what so when i got into then it's bid day or bid night i guess you could say so yeah then there's a little, little party and then you celebrate so yeah i'm really excited um but yeah i'm really excited so on to the future I'll see you guys tomorrow bye <laughs>
for any other sorority and that um, if you don't like your bid you can drop it and then rush till next year so just a bunch of different things I don't know if every school is like that but for my school it was like that um, but yeah I hope I really like it I'm excited I'm acting like I'm gonna get this house I find out tonight it's had uh, tonight at 6 p.m. so I'm excited I'm gonna run home hopefully I like the people I get oh I'm scared but I feel like I will so yeah I'm excited and I will update you guys very later in the night I love you guys guys I really want to show you my outfit before I see you guys later I was this is my makeup Watch my TikTok videos if you haven't seen it. I did like a whole like little get ready with me. And then I did my hair like this with the little bangs out. I just like scrunch up my hair like normally. And then I have this, don't mind this, it's my lip gloss. I have this beautiful blue dress from Princess Polly. I got so many freaking compliments on it. It is literally so freaking beautiful. I love it. Like it suits me so well with the little neck piece and everything. And this is the bag. Like, don't tell me how, like, this is not the cutest thing you've ever freaking seen. It is so freaking cute. So cute. And I've literally gotten so many freaking compliments on it. I love. And then these are my beautiful shoes. I think I got it from Nordstrom or Macy's. I don't remember, but it should be one of those. But yeah. This is my outfit and I'm excited for tonight. I have no idea what I'm gonna wear. It's supposed to be like, what's it called? Like a basic bottom. I wanna wear like um, jean skirt, but I don't have mine. So I'm gonna like search around and then like just a basic top. Cause they're gonna give us a shirt. So yeah, I'm so excited. All right, guys, I'm ready. One, two, three. Okay. day after bid day I got Sigma Kappa these were this was my one of my options one of my top five options and I didn't get like one of them that I really wanted um I don't know I like talked to them tabling before like rush and everything 
and I really enjoyed talking to them and when I talked to them I enjoyed it as well but I guess they didn't feel the same way or something but I really like this one because I felt like the philanthropy really like meant a lot to me I did it in high school it reminded me back home and a personal touch to it as well and then I don't know the girls were super nice um I feel like I could really connect with them and just like kind of like have fun um so yeah I feel like everything comes for a reason but look at the cute shirt isn't that so freaking adorable I have so many pictures it was Barbie theme and they one of the girls gave me this balloon she's literally so sweet everyone was so nice she's literally so sweet and you know how like you open like your card for like bid day yeah I ripped that sh card apart but I got my Sigma Kappa card. How beautiful. So freaking cute. I'm pretty sure the colors are. I don't know if it's purple, but I think it might be pink as well. Um, we love a little like pink and purple. And they gave me stickers. They're so cute. And look, when I ran to them, they gave me this pink card. Pink card. They were so sweet. I met so many other girls. We actually went to one of the restaurants called The Barn and they hosted like their own thing. Each everybody has their own thing so whether they go to a restaurant or they go to a house or they do anything they do, they have an activity planned. So my sorority, it was Barbie thing we went to this restaurant and it was super cute. I took so many pictures. If you haven't already seen my Instagram or followed it, please go check it out. I'll leave the description. I'll leave the ad in my description below. Thank you this super cute backpack. Look how a and it's literally so freaking adorable and it says Sigma Kappa. Literally so adorable. And they need these little keychains. They're so cute, guys. And I got this beautiful cap. I might not put it on because my bow's on, but like, look how cute this cap is. It's literally so cute. It's so beautiful. And then I got these glasses. They literally slay so much. They're so cute. And then they had tacos, they had fruit, they had dancing. We played this bingo game, your girl won. And yeah, they're just super cute, fun. Um, I'm really excited to see how it goes. I hope my rush process, as much as I like them during rush, I hope it continues. Um, but yeah, I'm super excited and yeah, on to the next adventure for College Diaries and on to my new journey. I am super excited. Everyone in my hall was super sweet and they were like, yeah, so yeah, I'm really excited. On to the new journey. Um, thank you all so much for tuning in or watching today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video, the rush process and everything and i will see you guys very very soon bye everyone